Pay friends and welcome to Norris Cove. I'm Yoshida. You guys, I'm doing a different video today. Well, I think I've seen them before, but I'm doing an unstuffing. Um, the reason I'm doing this is because the past couple of weeks, I've just been taking, taking, taking from my sinking funds and funds to fund my regular bills. So today I decided I'm going to do an unstuffing and a slight stuffing. So if you guys remember, this is my week ahead. I want to see how much I have in that. It's 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, and 60. I have 60 in that. Also, I'm not going, I decided I'm just not going to do the 100 envelopes at the moment. Let me get those. So I want to get, I need to get ahead. So I'm going to be putting money in my week ahead. So I think I only stuff like three of these envelopes. Also, um, these are still available on my Etsy. The link should be below. And I think I finally figured out how I needed to list them as well. So I think I only have like maybe $14 or something. So this is 13 So, yeah, so I'm just going to unstuff these, put it in appropriate places. And the only other thing I'm doing is I'm going to be taking it out and putting it up for my bills. Because, like, my car note is due tomorrow and I don't have it all. I do have some cash in my wallet. That's why I'm not doing a cash stuffing because I just have a little bit of cash in my wallet. So, I need to um, put that in the bank. So what else will we be unstuffing? Oh, also, while I'm thinking about it, I'm not going on vacation now. I just went ahead and told, I was going with my coworkers, and I just went ahead and told them that I'm just not going to be able to do it because y'all, my bills, I'm not sleeping well, and part of it is just bills, and I want to be able to go to bed, okay? And I'm going to want these bills to stop me. So I did take money out of this either last week or this week. I can't remember. So we should have around 300 and something. Let me see. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 120, 140, 160, 180, 200, 220, 240, 260, 280, 300, 320, 340, 360, 375, and 77. This is going to the bank. Because it's just eating me up that, you know, now, the one in five challenge I really want to do. Um, I want to kind of keep my taxes. And I think I took from my emergency fund. So I'm going to take 10. I'm going to add that to my emergency fund. But this here will be going to the bank. And then... One, two, three. We have $10 here. 13. I didn't do Christmas. I'm not funding Christmas again this week. So I'm going to put 10 in Christmas. And I'll catch up Christmas. Like, it's, I'm really, let's see how much we got in Christmas. Now we have 100, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 240. So we got 240 in Christmas. And I, like I said, I am going to catch that up. I'm going to try to put 60 in here. And then the one in five challenge, I did take from this challenge. I'm not going to count it, but I think I should have like $56. Not going to take that out. And matter of fact, I'm just going to put the $3 in there because um, right now I just, I'm finding that I'm worried about this. I'm stressed about this 100 envelope challenge and like, it seems like a lot and I could save it. And it seems easy, but the right now the money is just not there. So now, um, like I said, this is going to go to paying my car note. I am going to put a little extra on my loan. Um, if you have not seen that video, I'll try to remember to link it up above. But I'm trying to pay down some debt. And I'm going to put it towards that loan, even if it's like an extra 50 or 20 or whatever I have left after my bills come out. Because I haven't been in a negative in my bank account in a long time. And I'm really just trying not to be there. And I'm just trying to be responsible. So to me, the responsible thing to do was to um, get rid of the... Um, 
the savings challenges that I'm just struggling to keep up with. The um, Like I said, I still have my one in five. I may keep that. And to just say, hey, I can't really afford to go on vacation because I kept dipping into my vacation money. Like I said, August, I was ready. But, you know... And I want to hurry up and get into the week ahead. So the envelopes um, going forward that I will do my best to contribute to is definitely the week ahead. Debt. Um, like I said, I'm still riding the fence on the one in five. Who knows next week? I may be like, y'all, I needed my one in five. So um, this definitely helped me get ahead, though. This here and emergency fund and, you know, just whatever else that I have extra for. So... I wanted to make sure that I'd made a video to show you guys. I'm still doing the video on my planner, um, showing you guys how I'm going to set that up. But I had ordered something for it and it got sent to me, but it wasn't what I ordered. I got the wrong order. So now I got to wait for her to resend it, me my order. And then um, I'm going to do, I was going to do my October budget recap. I mean, it's never too late. I mean, September, excuse me. September budget recap is never too late. I'm going to do that. And that's all that I have for you guys today. So again, this will be going to the bank, pay on some bills, and just kind of float me a little bit. If there's anything else left besides me putting extra on that loan, but just to help float me through, um, you know, just getting through these um, tough couple of weeks, you know, I haven't dipped in my Christmas savings, which I'm so excited about. So prayerfully, I don't have to do that because now there's nothing else left really to kind of take from. So that is it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If today was your first time watching any of my videos and you enjoyed today's video and you would love to see more content from me, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. Also hit that notification bell and give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment in the section, in the comment section, so that I know that you're new. I will talk to you guys later. Bye.